Welcome to you, Team J, and we are back here with another video of Brave Frontier. What is going on? Oh my god, a crazy, crazy weekend so far. Really, really quickly, let me tell you what has happened, what's been going on. Oh my god. Alright, so, um, I went to Great Adventure on, was it yesterday? No, it wasn't yesterday. It was Friday. So Friday, I go to Great Adventure, right? And um, I told you guys that I put my my Brave Frontier, my Japanese Brave Frontier, I was able to put it on my phone. Um, my old phone, my iPhone 4S. And um, and it was good because I was able to bring it, you know, I was, I was able to bring it around with me. And then just, um, it's not connected to a, a carrier, um, a cell phone carrier. So I just use it just for Wi-Fi. And then uh, what I normally do, what I've been doing is I've been using um, my main phone as a hotspot and then just running my Brave Frontier um, Japanese and just, you know, just trying to grind and level up that way. So I went to Great Adventure. I brought both my both my phones, of course, and I, you know, as I'm kind of like, you know, um, enjoying uh, Great Adventure, I'm kind of just leveling up and doing some stuff on the side here and there. And so... Um, I decided to go on El Toro in Great Adventure, which is a which is an amazing uh, roller coaster. So I go on El Toro, right? And I'm like, all right. Um, I have both my phones on me, and I'm like, uh, it's just a good idea. And I had on a pair of uh, basketball shorts. Um, my my newer iPhone, which is the six, which is the oh my god, the six plus. Yeah, I think it's six plus. And um, it was kind of like sticking out my pocket. So I'm like. Um, I go on with my son and I'm like, hey, you know, um, hold my phone because there's, there's no way that I could ride this roller coaster with the thing out of my pocket. And so I give him my my um, my bigger phone and then my smaller phone, my little 4S, I decided to keep in my pocket. Uh, and because I my pockets were pretty big, but um, they were so big that I was able to put the phone underneath my leg. And I, I felt that it was secure there. Um... What happened was we st I get on the roller coaster and of course I lose my phone. So I was like, okay, first of all, the phone doesn't cost that much. The phone is like a, probably like a fifty dollar phone. What was more important was the freaking Japanese Brave Frontier that was on there that I had transferred from my iPad to my iPhone. So of course, naturally, I'm like, oh my god, how am I gonna get this account back? I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna have to contact Gumi. I'm gonna have to see if I get my account back. I start like, you know, thinking about all the tunes, all the units that I have, and the types, and what I've done, and what I've done last, and oh my god. So I send them an email, and um, you know, I, I'm asking them, hey, this is my account. Can you please give me my account back? I, you know, I've, I, I gave them all the list of uh, units that I have, and the levels, and what I did last, and whatever. And um, and then it turns out that. Um, it turns out that um, I was able to recover the account on my own because my old iPad, at first I didn't know the code that I had generated. I thought I had lost it. But what I did was, thank God that I did it, is I, I, took, a, I took a screenshot of that page where, you, where it comes up where you do set your password and your the code and your password, and I got it on my iPad. So I saved it. So I was able to go back into my iPad and put those that information into my iPad, and boom! I got my account back. Dude, I was so excited. So, I got my account back and as you can see here, my um my Japanese account is slowly but surely creeping up on the global account. And I, I told you guys it took me like probably like about a week um to get like about 100 levels. And I'm dude, I I told you I'm leaning more towards the Japanese version. The only thing now that I'm, I'm I have to figure out is um how do I um buy gems on the japanese side because for some reason i think i think i know a way I, i'm gonna have to figure it out hopefully i could um i could get it done because that's that's the only thing that's kind of you know slowing me down on both sides i got 13 gems um and uh let me let me tell you okay so i i got a i did a i did a whole bunch of rare summons on the japanese side i i, I once upon a time i had 100 gems and then I kind of like, you know, spread it around. I got some extra uh, space uh, for my items and uh, for my units. And I'm still kind of not where my global side is at, but I'm, I'm, I'm getting there. I'm getting there, which is pretty, pretty nice. Um, okay, so uh, we got three arena runs um, on global, which I'm going to show you guys. And I'm going to show you guys the win streak that I'm currently on. And then I'm going to show you one one on the, uh, the Japanese side. And then I'm going to show you 
the new love of my life. And I think I'm going to actually um, do a, um, a, uh, an evolve with, with, the, with the latest fire that I got. The one that I'm most in love with and I have a new love. And I'll show you guys my old love, and then I'll show you my previous love, and then now my new love. Really quickly, hopefully I can get this done really fast. Um, I'm, out, I'm also going out tonight. Um, I've yet to do a live stream. I am going to do a live stream, guys. Please be patient. But I, as you can see here, guys, I'm, I'm back into this game, man. I mean, level 242 on the Japanese side. I'm excited. Oh, oh my God. I can't, I can't wait. All right. So real quickly. So um, let's do a little arena run here. Oh, don't tell me this. Oh. Okay, yeah, that's because um, I had to like um, um, reinstall uh, Brave Frontier Global on my iPad because that's what I'm probably going to be um, um, streaming it off of my big iPad. And then um, most likely all of my work and everything that I'm going to do from now on is going to be on my, um, my iPhone. And um, I have my Japanese. I found a way to get the Japanese version on my main phone. And so now I got both global and Japanese on my main phone, which is what I wanted to begin with. So um, let's see how long this is going to take. Hopefully it won't take too long. In the meanwhile, I will get going on the Japanese side here. And we'll, we'll, um, we'll get you guys a quick uh, arena run here. And I, I really don't look around for the best, uh, the best matchup. I just let it rip. Um, and I've, ad I've added um, one of my new units to this group here. It's still not 100%, guys. I probably will get blown out, you know. So um, uh, I still got, I still have an Oracle Vernil in here. I, I like Bestie. Uh, Krantz is Oracle as well. I do like uh, Maha Mahalu, I think her name is. Uh, she's pretty cool. Uh, so let's see what happens if I don't get it. Okay, uh, so Vernil gets a Bray Burst off, which is, oh my god, I'm Bestie too. It might be, it might be a wrap. Oh, nice, 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 nice. Okay, so yeah, so on the global side, guys, I guess I'm going to have to um, download this content again, which is going to take a while. So I can't show you anything on the global side. I can't show you my arena stuff. But what I can show you, and this is what the video is about, uh, really, is um, actually, oh, my old love, I can't show you. I could tell you. Um, so I think, um, what's, oh my God, what was her name? Damn, I forgot her name. I still have her too. Um, crap, man, I forgot her name. Anyway, she she was a dark unit, and basically, I um the type of unit that she was was uh, she was able to generate um uh, brave brave crystals uh, brave crystals um upon getting hit, and so um they they still haven't they still haven't given her a seven star. I don't believe. Oh my god, I forgot her name. Anyway, um so the next love of my life was um Diana. And Diana was a similar unit like that, and I, I, I liked her for that simple reason. She was like an upgrade version of uh, the old unit, and um, she was a Thunder unit. And then now, oh my god, I fell in love with this new unit, and here she is right here. Oh my god, and I believe her name is Felice, if I'm not mistaken. I think her name is Felice, and um, I'm going to pull up her numbers really quickly so you guys can see why I am uh, such in love here. What's her unit number? It's 375. Give me one second. It just this thing doesn't crap out. As you can see here, my um, my global version is installing on my iPad. Okay, so yeah, she's right here. I'm going to pull her up. And um, yeah. Okay, so boom. Let me just get her pictures right. Let me just get her thing right here. We'll do a... Um, we will do a screen capture so we could get a picture of my 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 new uh, my new love. And here she is, guys. Okay, I'll put it right here in front of the this because. Okay, so here we go. Um, so so she's a female, um, and she goes to anomaly, which is a um, level one fifty, and then um. As, let me see if I scroll down here. Yeah, we can scroll down here. Okay, so we're going to see here. Um, so here's the base stats for her. Um, I happen to have an animal version, so my stats are going to be lovely. Okay, so um, so let me see if I can. Can I stretch this out? Oh, my God. I don't know if I can stretch this out. No, I probably can't. Okay, so I'm just going to just... Just, I, I'll just read off of most of it here, but as you can see here, 40% uh, 40, 40 boost to all parameters is our leader skill. Considerably boost BC efficiency and hugely boost BB gauge each turn and when attacked. 
Oh my god. Okay, our extra skill is boost, attack, defense, and wreck when BB gauge is over 50%. Amazing. Um, her Brave Burst, 35 combo, earth attack on all foes, hugely boost BB gauge for 3 turns, and damage taken considerably boost BB gauge for 3 turns. That is what I love about her. Uh, Super Brave Burst, 45 um, power for earth attack on all foes. Hugely boost BB gauge for three turns. Damage taking steadily boost BB gauge for three turns. And spark damage boost BB gauge for three turns. Amazing. Let's go to the UBB. 50 combo on all foes. Adds enormous spark vulnerability for three turns. Enormous boost to BB gauge and BB attack for three turns. Adds spark critical for three turns. What else could I ask for? Oh my god. Amazing. Amazing. I am in. I'm in love, guys. I am in love. Okay, so um, let's um, hold on. Okay, we're gonna take that off. And what we're gonna do now in this video is that we are going to we're gonna evolve this bad boy. Okay, because I wanted you guys to see it. I got all the materials. Um, crazy thing, um, silly thing actually. Well, I, I didn't know. I, I didn't know. Um, I didn't take a look at the um, the requirements for the for the Omni when you when you evolved them. So that whole time that I ran the the experience dungeon and the Karma dungeon, I had like I had the equal amount. I had the same amount of uh, Zell that I had Karma. And so what I did was is I um, I went to the town and I actually upgraded a lot of stuff that I didn't do previously. And so I ended up wasting, I don't know, like 10 million uh, uh, karma. And then to realize that I need, you, they've added this requirement that you need karma to evolve your seven stars to Omni Fighters. So I was like, oh my God. So now I had to go back and farm some more karma. And finally, I have I have a little over a million karma, which is uh, required to get this Omni Fighter. And so here we go. Bam. And I think this is going to be my first my first Omni Fighter on the Japanese side, and I'm excited. I'm super excited to have this one, and um, she's going to get all the bells and whistles to her added to her. And let me just take a quick screenshot of that because I'm going to definitely um, I'm going to definitely put that on um, Instagram, dude. I'm excited, man. Look at that. Look at her numbers. I think I'm able to add some more. Um, um, boost to her her, her um, parameters there and then i also have to evo um level up her um her braid burst again and her leader skill and i'm gonna do that um in a little bit um thank you guys for watching uh don't forget to favorite like share and subscribe if you want to see more as you see here on the global side i'm, I'm reinstalling uh the global brave frontier on my ipad um and very very soon man, i got everything lined up I'm excited again about Brave Frontier. I'm also playing a little bit of Diablo 3 New Seasons. Um, I haven't really... Um, I dropped off on um, on Hearthstone. I know the new Karazhan ex expansion came out, which I'm, I'll be playing soon. Uh, World of Warcraft came out. Well, not came out, but it's, going, it's coming out on, on the 30th. I'm not sure if I'm going to dive into that. I've been doing a lot of Brave Frontier and Diablo 3, so stay tuned for that. Thank you guys so much. Peace.